When your organization is working remotely, you may be wondering if your IT team can keep up, especially without physical access to devices. In this video, we'll show you how to do that with Absolute. With a remote workforce, it gets harder to reliably perform routine IT tasks because traditional tools become unreliable off-network. Instead, you can use Absolute Reach to gather information and perform any action you need to on any device or group of devices, even when those devices are off the corporate network. Absolute Reach is our remote query and remediation tool for Windows and Mac devices. With Absolute Reach, you can quickly perform routine tasks at scale, like setting admin passwords or installing applications using an EXE or MSI file. As an example, if you're locked out of a remote machine, you can add a local user with Reach to regain access and perform any necessary tasks. Let's add a local user to a remote device right now. First, we'll need to navigate to the Assets area to target a particular device, or many devices. We'll select this endpoint device. When selecting an endpoint device, you'll notice that the actions are available on the top bar. In this case, we'll select Run Script. This is our Absolute Reach scripting library. Here, we can look for Add Local User just by typing it in, then click Select Script. Here in the Set Script Configuration area for Add Local User, we have some required variables. First is the username. We'll call it Test1. Associated full name, also Test1. Then we'll need to write a description. We'll call it a testing account for access to that endpoint device. There are some minimum requirements for this associated password field. Note that you should keep this password handy and at your disposal to reach out to the end user that is applying this change. We want to enable this account when the script makes it to the remote endpoint device. Scrolling down to the Advanced Configuration Options area, the default settings are available and will work in this situation, but feel free to change it as you see fit. Now press Next. Here, we're going to confirm the devices this script will be reaching out to. This one particular device has been targeted, and we can simply press Run Script. Now the script is in the system, waiting for the next call in by the endpoint device. We can check this by looking at the event history. You'll notice the script has been requested and is awaiting further instructions from the endpoint. Once completed, you'll get the following message stating the script has succeeded and should have a value of zero, indicating successful execution of the script. Once again, this is how to add a local user with password to a remote endpoint device using scripting from Absolute Reach. As you can see, Reach gives you a simple, reliable way to complete an important task that might normally require physical access to the device or for it to be connected to the corporate network. There are many other IT tasks that you can remotely perform with Reach, such as force application installs or uninstalls, update registry settings, or adjusting multiple device settings at scale. The list goes on. There are over 120 pre-built scripts in our Reach library, and you don't need any scripting knowledge to make use of them. Although, you can also create your very own scripts using PowerShell or Bash. To learn more about Absolute Reach and the Absolute platform for resilient endpoint security, visit us now at absolute.com.